When we write a fraction such as three quarters, this line means divide. So we can write three quarters as three divided by four. And that is the calculation we do to change the fraction to a decimal. We write out the division and start by trying to divide four into three. Four won't go into three, so we rewrite the whole number three as a decimal number by writing it as a 3.0 or with several zeros in case we need more than one. Now we can do the division. Four into three goes zero times remainder three. Four into 30 goes seven times remainder two. Four into 20 goes five times exactly. So three quarters as a decimal is 0 0.75. To change a decimal to a fraction, for example change 0 0.75 into a fraction, we look at how many decimal places are in the number. There are two decimal places, so we have gone as far as using the hundredth column. So we write the figures after the decimal point. In this case 75 over 100, then cancel the fraction down. 25 will go into the both numerator and the denominator. 75 divided by 25 equals 3. 100 divided by 25 equals 4. 3 quarters cannot be cancelled down any more, so 0 0.75 as a fraction is 3 quarters. To change 0 0.7 into a fraction, we can see that there is one decimal place in the numbers so we have gone as far as use the tenth column. So we write the 7 over 10, which can't be cancelled down, as there is no number which divides exactly into both 7 and 10. So 0 0.7 as a fraction is 7 tenths. In everyday life, some fractions and decimals are used more commonly than others, and the table shows some common equivalents. It can be helpful if you can remember these off by heart. One tenth is 0 0.1. One quarter is 0 0.25. One third is 0 0.33. One half is 0 0.5. Three quarters is 0 0.75. If you can't remember them, we can work them out using the methods shown.